Mr. Marrow here to see you? Jamie, I'm trying to downsize here. Um, Mr. Vogel, I'm not sure I'm adequately conveying Mr. Marrow's size. Get him out of here! <laughs> or send him in. Wow. Thanks, Jamie. You must be Mr. Marrow. I've heard about the connections Altor has. You're gonna get my boys out of jail and help me destroy the Saints. Your bargaining posture needs some work. The Saints killed my girlfriend and crippled my best friend. And that's unfortunate, but Altor is a business and there's no profit in revenge. Don't worry about the door, though. That one's on me. Fine. You want money? In a few days, a shipment's coming in- Mr. Marrow, nebulous shipment or not, I think I made myself quite- <laughs> Let's try this again. You're gonna help me destroy the saints. An old tour would love to be of service. Good. Stillwater Police Department. I need to talk to Troy Bradshaw. Who should I say? Do it! Chief, there's a Mr. Vogel on the line. Put him through. Hello, Troy. Yeah, what do you want, Vogel? It's not what I want, it's what I need. Which is? You are going to release all the Brotherhood you have locked up. And why the fuck would I do that? I'm looking after my clients. Your, uh, clients are a bunch of criminals. Guilty before a trial. Nice. Is that the kind of mentality you like to instill in your subordinates? Huh. <laughs> Spare me. All right, they're not getting released, and that's that. This is where we're going to have to agree to disagree. These men are going free. The only question is if you let this be settled quietly, or if you want a media circus that will make you look like a joke. I thought Altor wanted order. Okay, letting these assholes out is going to only make things worse. Troy, in order to maintain the ecosystem, sometimes the rangers need to start forest fires. You should know that better than anybody. I suspect I'll hear from you soon. <laughs>
<laughs> Sucker. That's a little more cheap than black. No way!
finally stopped. Esto es muy fácil. In a surprising turn of events, several members of the Brotherhood are being released today. A previously thought open-shut case turned into a fierce legal battle as several high-power attorneys fought tooth and nail for their clients' freedom. Curious about the court proceedings, I spoke to Chief of Police, Troy Bradshaw. My personal opinion on the trial doesn't really matter. They were found innocent by a jury of their peers. So you think they were guilty? I'm sorry, Jane. Listen, I have to get back to work. Hey, why don't you try talking to Dane Vogel? Mr. Vogel, what's Altor's interest in the trial? Altor has no interest in the trial other than to see criminals get put behind bars. So there is no truth to the speculation that the Brotherhood's lawyers are in Altor's pocket? Jane, we've donated millions of dollars to the Stillwater PD as well as rebuilt the shattered community of Saints Row. I understand that everyone likes to pick on the big corporations, but this latest groundless attack on Altor's integrity is just ridiculous. Behind me, the men and women loading up onto these buses are being given another chance at freedom. But the question remains, are we also giving them another chance at a life of crime? I'm Jane Valderrama, Channel 6 News. Back to you, Jack.
Brotherhood by boat. You gotta find a way to stop them before they reach the mainland. I'll take care of it. Thanks for the heads up, Jamie. Is there something I can help you with? They hit my boys when they were on the prison bus. Between your girlfriend and your gang, I'd say you're a magnet for tragedy, Mero. You think this is fucking funny? No, but I do think it's your problem. My problems are your problems. Or do you need some fresh air to remind you? No. See, my problem is that a sideshow freak is messing up my paperwork. Your problem is that there's a group of security guards with assault rifles pointed at your back. Your security guards look more like a private army. Call them whatever you want. The point is, they have big guns. I'm sorry you couldn't protect your friends. I really am, but old Tor's done doing you favors. Come back here again and I'll have you shot on sight. Go fuck yourself, Vogel. I've enjoyed our time together, too, but I think it's time to move on. Gentlemen, could you please show our guest out? And Mero, don't worry about your little shipment. Ultor has already appropriated it. What did you say? Ultor security is taking control of the boat carrying your goods. It only seemed fair that we get compensated for letting your boys out of jail. You can go now. That boat is never gonna make it to shore. Goodbye, Mero.
sucker a man into marriage that drained his soul dry. Shandi, meet me at Adam's Arcade. I gotta talk to you about the Brotherhood. something new. Yeah. 